All right, welcome back, guys. LG B50S Tin Q. All right, on this video, I'm going to show you how to unlock the boot loader. To unlock the boot loader, you must use a PC. A good working PC that will detect the device like this 200 and top right on the previous video I already show you the the way to flash the stock LG UI on this uh, LG TinQ SD855 series this is the driver how to install the driver just run the LG mobile driver WSQL version 4.5.0 this driver the ABL the engineering bootloader the firehose file uh, inside one folder I already upload it the link uh, in the description the bootloader can be used on LG G8 G8S G8 Tech V50 V50S right unlock the bootloader my device is still on Android 10 it's still uh, updating the software at the moment but I uh, don't worry about the software See. software update here At the moment, this is still an Android 10 system. You go to about device. This is Android 10. Hope you can see. All right. To unlock the bootloader, you need to enable the. Where is it? About one. Hardware info. You must tap the build number. Here, the build number. Inside the software info. Build number. Tap it a couple of times until you see. You are a developer, right? We enable the developer option by tapping the build number inside the software info, right? Got the system back. Now we got the developer option. Don't show again. Over here, you need to enable unlock OEM unlock enable enable the USB debugging okay USB debugging already enabled hello right the tool you need to use the QPSD any version the QFill this is uh, a set of the QPSD you see the driver are not properly installed symbol there but don't worry about that after this we try to fix this tool 
uh, all right first we need to put to uh, EDL mod since this device don't have the the bootloader the engineering bootloader the current bootloader you can boot into fast boot or EDL mod the way to boot into EDL mod is this is the volume button uh, eh, sorry power button on the right volume plus volume minus up and plus very minus hold it together until the phone restart you hold on when the phone restart keep pressing the volume plus volume minus and power button still holding keep pressing volume plus now we are in the Qualcomm Q loader 9008 this is the EDL mode right if uh, you don't see the EDL mode or the EDL mode you got uh, what you call it uh, triangular the yellow marking there you just run the driver LG driver with the device connected if you run the driver the device not connected the driver will not install properly connect the device first then you run the driver that's the way to install the driver now open your QPIL alright flat bill browse to the this is the firehost file add one five zero right you open that one over here change to UFS port com forty one right here over here I have to remove my last time so that I don't get confused with this thing this is the last LGG attack or G50 B50 backup all right now the device are connected this is the version of my Q field 2.0.3.5 flat bill this is the firehouse file go to tool partition manager first you need to back up your stock ABL A and ABL B either one both are the same actually or you can back up your boot A ABL A right click manage partition data read data add the folder over here we already got the backup you can rename it lg b 50 s what the hell rename LG V V P S A B L Oops, sorry A because I got so many LG device actually it's the same <laughs> but when you're using the stock ROM this is a must all right close now the boot a right click manage partition data read data now my boot a
v it is good a right again a b l b if you want to install window on this device there is a lot of partition you have to pack up the love xpl also the modem where is it uh, ablp yeah right click manage partition read data okay rename for yours if you got only one device just rename it abla or ablb it's up to you lg p 50 s a b l b right close again now boot b where are you boot b booby booby you can say it but I don't put it put B this one love love A love B XBLA XBLB also can be made up if that one corrupt well read that out right complete reading rename v 50 s put p so when you flash back this thing you know this is a boot going to boot partition abl going to abl partition whatever name you give you must remember that's abl and this is the boot boot image normally the size are bigger than the ABL ABL standard 1024 kilobyte the size all the LG device are the same now we are going to override the boot loader we already back up now override it with the uh, engineering boot loader because we want to unlock the boot loader ABLA manage partition make sure you lot the uh, uh, you get the uh, correct partition ABLA just now lot the image this is the engineering put loader we are going to override it finish sending image okay now the ABLB be careful over here ABLB right click manage partition lot image overwrite it with uh, this one you can rename it uh, engineering bootloader so you get you don't get confused with uh, stock all right as long you know that one engineering bootloader okay save partition if you're not sure you haven't done the save save it again don't worry all right partition are safe close done now we're going to put to the fast boot because we already got the bootloader exit this one the device are still in ADL mode see you need to reboot it hold the three button to make it on again until it restart all right the pawn are restart after this we're going to power off it so many fingerprints see 
Treiber. Don't worry about that driver. You can run the We're going to unlock the boot rider. Disconnect your camel. Power off the pawn. Power off. Alright, make sure the pawn power off completely. Now hold the volume minus. We're going to boot into the boot loader. Hold volume minus plus minus connect the cable on the volume minus now we got the uh, engineering boot loader she after this i restart the boot loader interface this is the wrong driver actually i hope it detect Open your command prompt. You can test fast. Okay, the device I detected. All right. Now we're going to unlock the bootloader fast boot. OEM and lock and enter. The device uh, lock now over here. You want to use a warning there, just unlock the boot loader at the bottom. Yeah, you see, you use your uh, volume button to navigate the instruction there. Go to unlock boot loader press power button all right we are unlocking the put loader just now the driver uh, it should be android put loader over here now the device are factory reset it erase all your user save data now the phone are unlocked that's it very simple b50s b50 b50 uh, lg g8 g8 g8s the procedure are the same the file also the same for the recovery, that one are different. The uh, custom ROM. This file I already uploaded. It. All of it, the ABL LG up tool. This one is a must. You must have it in case you run into problem. You need to flash the stock LG ROM. To flash this ROM, you don't have uh, to unlock the bootloader. Whether your bootloader lock or unlock, you still can flash using this LG app. On my previous video, I already show how to flash it using this uh, tool. Right? That's it. Our device already unlocked and once again thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video.